This is a quick review on multiplying a polynomial by a monomial. So let's look at an example. We have a monomial such as 3x. And we're going to multiply that by a polynomial 4x squared y minus 3y plus 12x y squared. So we have a monomial, one term, and a polynomial, which is multiple terms. Uh, we know from order of operations we're supposed to do parentheses first. But when we look at what's inside these parentheses, we see that there are different terms. They're not like terms, so we can't combine them. In which case, we have to use our distributive property to distribute what's on the outside each one of these terms. So I'm going to do 3x times the first term, 3x times the second term, and 3x times the third term. So let's use our, uh, our rules for multiplying uh, terms together. First multiply the coefficients, 3 times 4, 12. x times x squared, we just add the exponents, there's a 1 here. So that would be x cubed. And then there's no y's out here, so it's essentially 1 times y, which is y. Okay, now I have to distribute this to the second term. And this term here is actually negative 3y. We're going to treat this minus sign as a negative sign for this coefficient 3. So 3 times negative 3 is negative 9. We write it as a minus sign x times, well there's no x's over here, so x times 1 is x, and then 1 times y, y. And now we'll distribute this to the last term, so we have 3 times 12, positive 36, so plus 36, x times x, x squared, and then we have y squared. So, just to recap, we have a monomial, which is one term, and we're multiplying that by a polynomial, which is more than one term, and we do that by distributing the monomial to each one of the terms.